Tulip. I don't know what this game is, but I've seen it on the internet. Looks adorable, let's do it. Also, that tree don't look right. The first moment you saw her. A boy and a girl from two different parts of the world. They met and fell in love. A kiss of happiness. What is your name? Uh... Looks like Mario. Marlo. My name is Marlo. Are we getting married? Oh, this is fast. I do. Aww. Happily ever after. This is 3 2 Long Life Town. I didn't read that. Nobody knows where they are from. Secretly, quietly, and modestly. Marlo and his father moved in. By the way, the rent is 9,000. Father and son. There are only two people in the family. So let's make the most of our lives. So have they determined? What the... I don't get the story here. Me and my dad. Listen to me, Marlo. No matter how poor we are, we'll always be together. Take a break and then go say hello to our new neighbors. I'll clean up in the meantime. I don't want to. I want to stay inside and play video games, Dad. Alright, bye, Dad. What? You are going right away? That's my son. I'm so happy I could cry. However, it's sad that your heart is still weak. If your heart falls to pieces, you'll never recover. Take care as you explore. Alright, goodbye, Marlo. Wait, why do you have to go get philosophical on me, Dad? I'm just going outside, jeez. Oh? You want to use the toilet? When you go to the bathroom, your life is recorded. You should go to the bathroom sometimes to freshen up. So open the save screen. Ah, that's... okay. <laughs> nice one, Dad. I wanna save, yes. Alright, Dad. Now I'm out of here. Might wanna go in there for a couple minutes. Okay, time to meet the neighbors. Uh, are, they are they whispering? 
Hey, you hear what's going on? Oitsu. Oitsu. I can say hello. Why are they whispering? I want to eavesdrop. What is... What is... I don't know what that is. Alright, fine. Anything in the mail? Shabby mailbox. Uh, we can just hide. Nothing. Okay. Hello, neighbors. But in Bosset, first the best. But in Bosset, first the best. But in Bosset, it's the best. It's the best. The It's my first and boss with. What the hell? That damn jerks are talking about us. We just got here, like 15 minutes ago. Okay, why am I sneaking? I'm not trying to do that. Uh, I guess we'll just use the directional pad. Whoa. Let's go say hi. I see. You're the kid who moved into that house. You look like a nice kid. I'm Michelle. My house is in the first district near Turtle Bath. Turtle Bath? Why don't you come to my place tomorrow? Hee hee hee. Nice to meet you, kid. Hee hee hee. You know what? I don't think I'm... I don't think I want to visit you. In fact, I will do no such thing. Stop sneaking. Okay, can I sprint? No, I can't sprint. Not that kind of game. You don't sprint through a game like this one. You make friends and you live a happy life. That's what our dad told us. He told us you, 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 you get love, you give love. Learn to love. Otherwise, you, you perish or some shit. I don't know, I already forgot. Hello. How do you do? I'm Mr. Cheapot. I own the antique shop. Nice to meet you, Marlo. That is my dog, Rocky. Oh! Rocky! Rocky says, nice to meet you. Well, nice to meet you too, Rocky. Close already, the store is. Come back tomorrow. Okay. I will do that. I will pet Rocky. And maybe buy some things. Never mind, I can't do that. I am bored. Hello. Oh. I've never seen you before. Kids don't have to work. Grown-ups do. I envy you. <laughs> oh. Your family is very poor. Please excuse me. Ha <laughs> ha. I have no job. You have no money. I hope we can find a job soon. <laughs> Buddy, are you laughing at me? I love you know. I can be a very important person someday. And you'll regret saying that kind of shit to me. Please push the crosswalk button. Okay. The button is broken. Nothing works in this shitty ass town. I hate it here, Dad. Is there anybody else that I can meet? Oh, hold on. What's this? Big trash can. Oh, what's inside? Hell yeah! Cold sweet potato. I'll give this to my dad. And we can eat tonight. Man, this, this really is a sad game. I, I hope it's not always gonna be like that. <laughs> okay. Well, I think I met everybody. I'm going to bed. Coming in, Dad. All right, I met everybody. Oh, Marlo. Have you met our neighbors? Yes, I did. Anything on TV? Oh, Marlo. Have you met... Uh, okay, all right. Well, I'm going back out then. You won't fucking talk to me. I wonder if I can walk past her and talk to that doctor guy. Yeah, I can. How do you do, Marlo? I'm Dr. Dandy. Nice to meet you. Come to my hospital anytime. Okay. Okay, I guess some of the people are nice. Still, it's too quiet around here. 
Where's the bustling traffic? What are we in the 1940s? Yeah, it just might be true. Oh, it's my beloved. Hello. Hello. Nice to meet you. I'm Vivi. I live in Long Life Town. She's beautiful. Uh, okay. You just gonna stare at her forever, man? Come on, put yourself together. Hey, do you want to give me a kiss? Whoa, all right. A little forward, but <laughs> I ain't complaining. Of course. Just kidding. Oh, you bitch. I'm out of here. Fuck you. Oh, you kiss someone you just met? By the way, what's your name? I'm Marlo. Marlo. Weird name. Hey, fuck you. Are you the poor boy who just moved in here? Uh, nah, that's, <laughs> it's somebody else. It's the poor sap. This fucking man. Can you believe that shit? You see shoes? Uh, yeah, it's me. I knew it. So you are really poor. By the way, you've never kissed, have you? Yeah. <laughs> it's like a lot of girls. <laughs> I can't even count them. Not yet. I knew it. There is no way. You look so inexperienced. And you just moved here. You don't know anything. Jesus. You just gotta judge my whole life story? In this town, people kiss using the triangle button. What? But you can't kiss people that easily. Usually they'll get angry. Yeah, I, I, I'd be kind of angry too. Like the fucking kid kissing me, I'm trying to get to work. Understood? Nah, I, I really don't understand that. But uh, I guess for the sake of conversation, yeah. You're poor, but pretty smart, Marlo. But you are not my type. Oh, fuck. Uh, the day is ruined. Holy shit. I'm devastated. At least I didn't lose any hearts. But you know what? I was honest. That's all that matters. Because in the end, honesty always wins. You know, until it doesn't. You know, because people are assholes. They use it against you. That's why you gotta be careful who you tell the truth and who you don't. Some people just want to know that shit so they can feel good about themselves. Hello, pipe. Alright. Yeah, can I go talk to my dad? I'm ready to end this day. It's been a terrible one. I met some nice people, some not so nice people, a very strange lady with a face twitch. I don't know what the fuck that was. And uh, a girl who I fell in love with, but then immediately broke my heart. So, I'd say it's a full day. Alright, dad. Why? You met the girl you saw in your dream. Congratulations! It's fate. Go tell her how you feel. Dad, I don't... <laughs> Times have changed, man. I don't think you understand how, this, how any of this works. Go give her a kiss. No, no, you, you really don't understand, Dad. Like, I think you... Have you taken your meds today? Oh my fucking god. You gotta get me fucking... A, <laughs> you gotta be arrested for sexual assault, dude. I can't do this. I cannot do those things. I guess I suppose I can talk to her more. But you don't just, you don't push with these things, man. You gotta be patient. I know, you are the poor boy. You have a bad reputation. Mm. You're not my type. How do I fucking get reputation, man? They do missions? Kissing missions? That'd be weird. It's still broken. Okay, I can't leave this little square. Can't you just look both ways, man? Come on. Not that much traffic. What's the worst that could happen? You get by a car? You just shake it off. You can't go that way. Whoa. A kiss. I don't like that. I want to kiss my dad. Hey, dad, give me a kiss. 
You wanna kiss, Marlo? You won't get experience by kissing me. Go out and find someone else. What? But Dad, I love you. Okay, fine. Wait, is it my dad or my grandpa? I really wasn't paying attention. Alright, time to kiss strangers. This ought to be good. Hey, lady. Fuck her up. Ow! What are you doing? You really want to give me a kiss? <laughs> Ow. Well, you didn't have to fuck it. What the hell did you do to me? She drop kicked me? Uh, I don't want to kiss that guy. Might take a fucking surgical knife to my goddamn corro uh, correlated artery. However you say that. Okay, what if I just pop? A, what if I just pop a surprise kiss? Uh, would you like that? Would you like that? Ow! She didn't like it. I think that would work. Eek, weirdo pervert. I can't believe you tried to kiss me. What? No, you don't understand. My dad said to. You and I kissed in your dream. That's just a dream. This is reality. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't understand reality, you see. I don't think a lot of the people around here do. But you know what? You can't let your dreams be dreams, man. If you kiss in your dream, you kiss for real. Ah. This is much more painful, though. Oh. Oh! What are you doing all of a sudden? You are going to kiss me. We have to become friends first. <laughs> yeah, see, that's the thing. I don't know what to do. And all I can do is smooch people. And they whack me. And I'm assuming I will die if they whack me too much. I understand, these are deserved wax, because... My goodness, I, I wouldn't, I would not, I would not suggest to a child, What was my dad thinking? You don't just kiss random people. Dad, it didn't fucking work, man. You, you're tripping. You are heartbroken. However, as a person, Marlo, your father loves you from the bottom of his heart. Do you really mean that, Dad? Would a father who loves his son tell him to go out and sexually assault people? Cause, uh... That's... That's pretty fucked up. Oh, I get love back! I take it back, Dad. You alright? Why? You met the girl you saw in your dream, and when you tried to give her a kiss, your heart was broken. Is that right? That's okay. Don't worry. I have a plan to win her over. But wait, I don't think you want to get involved here, Dad. You're old. Operation Love Letter. Write a love letter using this. Huh? No, I can't find it. My letter set is missing. If only you had it, you could write a love letter. I definitely put it in this box. I really did! Oh, Dad. You and your... You and your fucking... Weirdisms. We're safe. Take a shit. Oh? Okay. I don't know if I can keep getting love back from my dad. So I, I'm not gonna risk it by kissing random people. Where's the doggy? Hey, man. A letter set. I've sold it to Batayan the other day. By the way, Rocky won't come home. Very friendly, my dog is. But he's angry when I am not around. Walk slowly in front of him. Rocky, where are you? Oh, this is why I sneak. Okay, you got it, dude. I'll bring your dog back, don't you worry. I might kiss him too, but uh, <laughs> that's just between me and Rocky. Then I, you actually probably shouldn't kiss dogs, actually. I'm in trouble. I don't know what to do.
I bought a letter set to use for my job search. <laughs> well, why? However, a dog stole it from me. I'm in trouble. <laughs> oh. That one, he stole my letter set. Ha <laughs> ha. I don't think this is a... I don't think this is the time to be laughing. Wait, you stupid dog. Good grief. Well, guess it's up to me. Yeah, we killed two birds with one stone here. Get the, the letter set from him, maybe. And, uh, get the dog back. And I gotta sneak. So watch how it's done, buddy. Just like this. You see me? You see what I'm doing? Just like this, it's easy. What the fuck? Hey, watch it. Okay, anyway. Sneaking. Look at me go. Yeah, nice and easy. Take it. Got the letter set. Yeah. Alright, now we gotta get Rocky. Come here, boy. No! Alright, well, fuck that dog. I got what I needed. Got the fucking letter set. So now I'm gonna bring it to my dad. And he's gonna help me write a letter to my beloved. Alright, Dad, I got it. You are heartbroken, however, as a person model. Your father loves you from the bottom of his heart. Why, thank you, Dad. You're a much special person, too. Oh, no, oh, no, where did it go? My letter said, don't worry, I got, I got something for you. It's right here. Oh, Maro. You found a letter set? And you took it from a vicious dog. You're pretty good, Marlo. I'm so happy I could cry. Now, write a love letter with that letter set right away. Well, that's the thing I was hoping you'd... All right, never mind. Yeah, we got this. All right. Dear Vivi. I really, really love you, Vivi. I love you very much. Please give me a kiss next time, and... That's a letter. Not bad. Great, great. Yeah, yeah. Go brag about it to our neighbors. Why would I do that? Okay. Man, you weird, Dad. But I got it. The love letter of the millennia. Let's see fucking Cosmopolitan teach this. Hey guys, check out my love letter. <laughs> nice to meet you, kid. Hee <laughs> hee. <laughs> okay, you still do that shit. Well, maybe you'll change your face when you see this. <laughs> oh, I see. You've written a love letter. <laughs> if that's a love letter, take it to the mailbox. <laughs> that's our town's custom. Hee <laughs> <laughs> hee. Okay. Stop doing that, lady. Hey. Good thing I don't need a stamp. Wait, you gotta do it. Did you do it? Nothing. Put it in the mailbox. Oh, wait, the town mailbox? Is there like a... An official mailbox? I don't know where that is. Seriously, I don't, I don't know where that is. What the fuck? Oh. You have to take care of your employees. Pay your workers. No one can live without money. I like this place. It's full of surprises.
Okay, new area. Got fucked up. Well, he was already fucked up. You see that nose? Yeah, he got fucked up twice. Hey, lady. Your face is bad. Everyone is so ugly in this game. Hee hee hee. I'm Miss Plum of the snack shop. You're Marlo, the poor boy. Jeez, word fucking gets around, doesn't it? Have some sweets to nurse your poor heart. Hee hee hee. Store hours are 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. Hee hee hee. Oh, you assume... You assume I'm a customer now, huh? You just called me fucking poor. I, I don't have any money to give you. But, uh, thanks. I mean, if you're talking free candy, I mean... <laughs> <laughs> so the cops are fucking mascots? Is that, the, is that your real body? Marlo. Nice to meet you. I'm the officer here. I keep Long Life Town nice and safe. Count on me with the night patrol. I see. You moved into that old house. That means you are poor? Oh my god, what is with the criticisms? You can't commit a crime just because you are poor. Well, try to stop me. You are the new guy in town. Your name is Marlo. I already know. <laughs> I'm the train conductor. I've been working here for 20 years. I bet you put the rock on the train tracks. No, 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 that wasn't me. Terrible. That's just terrible. You can't trouble people just because you are poor. You stupid kid. Wow. You're all assholes. I hate this place. Train station mailbox. Oh, I can put my letter in here. Yeah, let's do that. Did it. She's gonna <laughs> love it. Hey. Hey, you. Your love letter is terrible. How dare you? You will never touch her heart. Come to my room. I will show you how to write a love letter. I don't trust your words. In what fucking room? This one? It's locked. Whatever do you mean, Mr. Mailbox? Huh. Okay. I guess we don't really know who was saying that. Strange. Very, very strange. And he told me my love letter sucked. That's just rude. I mean, the least you could do is, you know, give some constructive feedback. I'd like to know, you know, that some editorials I can make. You know, I, I can enhance it. But don't just be mean. You can never understand how I feel. Buddy, you may be right. You can never understand how I feel. I... I know! 
I'm sorry. I guess I gotta understand how he feels to proceed. That could take that could take a while. Let's go meet the parents. <laughs> you. Who are you? <laughs> you are the kid of the poor family, Marlo. Yes. Yeah, that's me, the poor kid. Jesus. I'm Goral. <laughs> that's my wife. <laughs> I'm busy. Leave me alone. Okay. Hello, wife. What are you doing here, kid? I'm Julie. That's my husband. I run the bar to feed him. You've got something to say to me? Ah, Vivi. Where have you gone? I know where Vivi is. Guess I don't need to tell you, though. She's like... that way. Okay. Well, my letter sucked. I wanted to tell my dad. Hey, Vivi, your parents are weird. I guess you don't care. Yeah. This way. Ah, welcome. What? Okay. And the sewer? Oh, that's gross! I guess we're Ninja Turtles now. Oh my, you're the pole guy. And that's your real body. Man, I'm sorry. Oh, you're the poor kid, Marlo. I've been waiting for you. Sit. Ah, uh, who are you? I'm an underworld resident. Mich, uh, Michio Suzuki. This is a local apartment, Unit 103. Anyway, it is not important now. Your love letter is the problem. It's not good, not at all. Why are you making a federal case out of this, man? It's my first time. Why not? Why not? You don't know? It doesn't have your heart in it. You can't write a good love letter like that. A good love letter? If you can write a good love letter, you can kiss her under the legendary tree on the hill. However, even if you try to write a letter with your heart, your heart is immature and weak. Man, you people just love to kick while we're down, huh? You are at level one, poor boy. Before you profess your love to her, you need experience. Kiss others to strengthen your heart. Buddy, I tried that. It does the opposite of, of strengthen, I can, I can assure you. Let's begin your lessons. Wait. Come here, you lonely lady. Uh... Onion Lady is very angry. If you get close now, you'll get hurt. Onion Lady is happy. It's called Viva. Give her a kiss? I don't... I don't know what's happening. Can I leave? Now, let's start practicing. Kiss Onion Lady, Marlo. I, I, okay. Ow! She doesn't want to kiss me, man. I have to respect her fucking boundaries. No, no. You have to sneak up to angry people. Yo, did you... Did you just kiss me? I didn't ask for that. So I should have kicked your ass. Alright. Uh, we'll try this. We'll give this a shot. Sneak. Sneak. I'll just stand here. Sneak. And... Come on! Come on! Take the fucking onion off! Come on! Oh, shit! Wrong button! No! Not the sweet potato! Shit! This!
Okay then. Man, I have got a way with lips. You're welcome. Oh, she gave me money! Fuck yeah! Bravo, bravo. Marlo, you did it. Now your heart will grow a little bit. Now go home and tell your father what you did. Well then, goodbye. Take care. Okay. See ya. Well, that was something. Kissed an onion lady. And, uh, the little circle man told me to. Yeah, that, uh, that didn't make sense. My dad, my dad would totally understand. Oh, wow. Fix the place up. You are so late, Marlo. I finished cleaning a long time ago. Your father is very tired. You must be tired, too. Your new life in Long Life Town begins tomorrow. You should go to bed soon. Alright, but Dad, you gotta hear the day that I fucking had. Oh yeah, I guess I'll tell you tomorrow. Okay, so the objective is to kiss. Now this is a unique game. Good morning! Wake up! Okay, my son. Your new life in Long Life Town starts today. By the way, Marlo. Come and sit down before you go. There is something new in the paper. According to the paper, the suspects of Long Life Train Company rock incident are, uh, the residents of Long Life Town. Marlos family. Trouble! Big trouble! Our neighbors will think we are bad people. Marlo, go get rid of the rock. That's the only way to clear our names. What has the world come to? Have a good day, Marlo. How the hell am I supposed to do that, Dad? You have a big fat ass rock? Do people get paid to do that? It sure as hell ain't me.